Week 36, Day 2. Deep Foundation. Years and years ago, I took my two kids, and I was going to show them the house that I was raised in. And I took them out to the country, and we took them out there, and it was and one of my brothers was with us. And we went out there, and we looked. Wasn't anything but weeds and bushes and trees. You could not tell there had ever been a house there. And I said, what is this? And Jesse said, Dennis, the house had no foundation. It was built on pure and being. There wasn't any foundation to it. You see, if you don't have a foundation, there is no legacy. You are remembered for nothing. If you don't have a foundation, you're never going to leave a legacy. No one's going to ever remember that you were even here. Remember what Jackie Robinson said. If in the course of your life you don't have a positive impact on one person, you've wasted your life. What's he talking about? If you don't have a foundation and a positive foundation from where people can say, I want to be like him, he's my role model, you're wasting your life. If you don't have a foundation of integrity, and integrity is that foundation. Years and years later, I was in a, a, a large city, and I was in a hotel, and I was up on maybe the third, fourth, fifth floor, and I'm looking out, and I'm looking in the, next to me, and, and their construction crew is out there, a huge construction crew, and I'm looking out there, and I, the biggest hole in the ground you've ever seen. Now, there's nothing else there. They blocked off the sidewalks, and they're just a huge hole. So the next day, I go down, and I'm going to breakfast, and I stop, and these construction workers are there, and I stop, and I ask one of them, I said, what is it? Why such a big hole? And he said, the depth of the foundation determined the height of the structure. The depth of your foundation is going to determine how high you go. Well, in those two little examples that I've given you, there's two things I know about foundations. Number one, the deeper your foundation is, the deeper your integrity is, the higher you're going to go. The deeper the foundation is, the longer you're going to stay there. You see, John Wooden said, talent can get you to the top. You can get to the top. You can be the best player on any team with God-given talent. You can be so talented in the junior high or high school or college or even professional, that you can get to the top. But you can't stay at the top if you don't have character and integrity. You see, when the big winds come along and the storms hit, if you don't have a deep foundation, you're going to get blown away. You've got to have a foundation if anybody is ever going to remember you, you're going to have to have this big foundation, this huge foundation of integrity when the storms come in your life. And you have these crises and all these bad things happen to you and there's a real storm that comes along. How do you weather those storms? You weather those storms with an integrity. These 35 qualities that we've talked about, the persistence, the dependability, the responsibility, friendship, being a learner, being knowledgeable, being patient, all of these things, that's that foundation. That's that got to be deep and it's got to be embedded in you. And then when the storms come along and you get fired or you're broke or you lose or you fail in a class, if you don't have that foundation, you blow away. If you do have it, you remain 
straight and structured. If you've got that foundation, then a hundred years from now, they know who you are. These 300 greatest leaders that we've talked about, and you can argue, you can go and find that list and you can argue about it and say, I don't think he was one of the 300. But I'll bet you, you know who he is. There's not many people that don't know who Jackie Robinson is, Abraham Lincoln, Mahatma Gandhi, Jesus Christ. I don't care what your religious beliefs are. I don't care what your political beliefs are. You know who George Washington was. You know who Abraham Lincoln was. You know who Nelson Mandela was. And whether you agree with what they did or did not do, the reason you remember them is they had the foundation real deep. And so now you know who they are. If you're going to be remembered, when they put you in the ground more than three days after it's over, it's going to be because of the impact you have on someone else. And you're not going to have an impact on anyone else unless you're a role model. And you're never going to be a positive role model until you develop this foundation. And that's what this curriculum is totally all about giving you a foundation. See you tomorrow.